guys welcome or welcome back to my channel so in this video we will be swatching my favorite lipsticks i have a lot of lipsticks you oh god i have to show you guys how much lipsticks i own so oh no but i'm literally gonna show you Okay, two, three lipstick are still there, but this is how much lipsticks I own and I have some of lipsticks in my cupboard. Basically, I use lip glosses or even though I'm using a lipstick, I put lip gloss over it. So, I'm a gloss girly, so if that was helpful. Plus, today it's raining. It's March, but still it's raining. It's literally spring season. Why is it raining? I hate raining season. I'm such a spring girly because I am born in spring. I love spring. I love how beautiful and vibrant it is. But then it's raining now. So I don't like rainy season at all. I also don't like winters. I'm such a, I'm such a spring and summer kind of person. So today is not a good day. But. We're gonna swatch some lipsticks and make it a good day so also one thing i want to say that i am warm skin tone not like not very warm but like i would consider myself neutral warm so even if i wear cool tone colors i get with it but on me i've personally observed that vibrant colors or like very crisp colors look good on me also, muted colors kind of wash me out and also make me look ugly, borderline ugly. And that's why I don't use muted colors because nobody wants to look ugly. Okay, the next thing is I've also personally observed on myself that light colors look good on me. Maybe because of my facial features or stuff like that. But dark, if I put on dark lipsticks, yeah, then again I become, yeah, then again I kind of look very tired and not cute at all. That's not a cute look on me. But if you like dark colors, I don't have any dark colors. So, yeah, I have reds. I have bright reds, orangish reds, and yeah, those are the only dark colors I have. But I wouldn't consider them dark. They are on a brighter side of the reds and oranges. So if you are into a dark, if you are into dark lips or dark lipsticks, I don't have any. But also, if you're considering to have new lipsticks that are on a brighter side i have a lot of options for you i got three browns these two are the browns that i have right now with me and i have one more brown which is a bit dark like chocolate color kind of browns and this one is more like glittery it's gloss and it's a bullet lipstick it's not dark brown it's apricot brown or a bit of orange and champagne colors mixed in it as you can see it's not dark brown it's matte riot or riot again i'm sorry if i'm mispronouncing it matte riot lipstick in the shade 284 brown sugar it's chamber i i, I think it's chamber 284 brown sugar so it's very beautiful i'm gonna apply it on half of my lips so that i can show you the other one with gloss so it's this color I 
again as you can see this color is kind of washing me out and it's not looking as cute as it would look on some other girls and also i feel like this will this would look good on um medium to dark skin tones who has cool tone this is a cool tone lips sorry who has warm tone this is a warm tone lipstick this is not for cool tone girlies and on the other side i'm going to use this gloss this is by tint cosmetic this is a smaller version they have a 400 something for medium version and then they have 700 something for the tallest tube i'm sorry if i'm if i'm saying it wrong because i've seen three size tubes this is the smallest version and they have other two one is medium one is a, a bit longer than the medium one uh, this is the shade caramel latte Let's just get into the... It has very sheer consistency. But it's... It has um, little sparkles on it. So if you don't like sparkles, I wouldn't, I wouldn't consider buying this one. But if you like sparkles, you should definitely get this one. So this is the gloss. See, gloss is shiny and that's why it's making my face a bit better. And even if it's stone, I personally am a gloss girl. So I like glossy things and shiny things and glittery things. So I would consider this side better. But if you're a matte person, this is not completely matte, this lipstick. But it's not also shiny. It's, I would say it's a little bit moisturizing. It's not at all matte kind of formula. It's moisturizing and uh, really lightweight on the slips. So it's look giving that moisturized kind of balm look. It's not matte lipstick. It's like more like a lip balm. This gloss will suit every kind of girl, okay? Whether you're fair to fairest or dark to darkest shade. This is for you. I feel like this was 300 to 400 when I purchased it. I'm not sure. Again, I really recommend you all to see on Google by yourself. Nice little water. Okay, white. So these five red lipstick, I know all of them kind of look orangish a bit because I am neutral warm. So I'm definitely going to be inclined towards warm. So I have warmish red more than neutral red. This is warmish red. This one is neutral red. This is neutral red. This one is uh cool tone red this one is warmish red and this one is i feel like it's neutral too warm i'm not sure about this color okay i have two glossy kind of thing it's not gloss but it's not matte okay it's glossy it's not a gloss it's lipstick but it's not matte it's glossy Okay, I don't know what I said. So first, wait, I'm gonna go with this gloss. This is literal gloss. It has shiny particles. Can you see that? It has a little bit of shiny particles in it. It's by Faces Canada. Beyond Shine in the shade. Sorry guys, I don't have the shade name on it. 
but i feel like this uh faces canada launched three to four shade range in this one um beyond shine and i feel like this is the red one you will easily identify which color i'm talking about they have one pink one clear gloss i guess and one red and i feel like one is a peachy or brown shade this is red for me it looks so beautiful you guys see the glass it's shiny and it's not too much i feel like if you're someone who likes muted colors or dark colors this will kind of feel like too much on the starting when you're gonna use this but i'm used to glossy things and light colors so this looks perfectly fine to me and this is an everywhere kind of lip gloss. You don't need anything before it, after it. Just apply this one, one swipe and you're good to go. And the next one was this. It's more like lipstick. The formula is more lipstick kind of thing. But it's not lipstick. It's glossy. It's, it's literally glossy. And this is by Nika. In the shade Slay 11. It's Slay 11. This is also orangish kind of glossy kind of thing. But this one is more pigment pigmented as you can see. Also I'm not underlining or overlining anything. This is on my bare lips. So you can see how it will look on your bare face because I haven't applied anything here. I've just concealed my eyes there. So this is the shade. It's more sheer and it will not hide your pig pigments if you have any. And this is more pigmented and more glossy, which I love. So, I like this one better, but, 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 I really like this one better, but this is also a nice option. This is very sheer and casual. This is for casual look and together or a party, this is the one you should be going with. I feel like this will suit everyone, but especially you if you have medium to tan skin medium tan brownish kind of skin chef's kiss not a matte kind of girl i'm literally glossy glossy girl so this is the next shade it's it's more like a lip balm but very pigmented it's by color bar it's color bar Cream as, as, sorry, cream me as I am lip color. Rosier livers. I'm not a French person, so I don't know if that's, I don't know if that's even a French sentence word. You know what I'm saying. This is very lip, lip balm kind of thing. It's glossy, but more on lip balm version of gloss. This is also nice. This is very easy to apply. Wait a minute, guys, because my uh, my battery is about to die. I'm going to take out my mic and I'm going to put my charger in. So maybe the sound will not be as clear as it is right now. I'm sorry for the inconvenience, but my battery is about to die. And I really want to put this video on my channel by today. So... I'm really sorry but i'm about to take my mic off it i don't know how you're how the audio is coming but i have taken out my mic 
so it's it's being recorded by my phone itself red color it's very unique and beautiful color it's again light because I like light colors dark colors do not look good on me so everything I'm showing you guys it's dark sorry it's light yeah it's very sheer yeah, it's sheer but if you swatch four to five times because it's very sheer so if you want very pigmented you need to swatch it for four to five times so this was the color it's looking orange but it's not that orange i mean it kind of looks reds kind of look orange on me if it's um, warm tone red because of my undertone i guess i'm not sure but all reds whose uh, undertone is warm like on a warmer scale it kind of blends in my skin and it becomes orange for some reason so this is looking orange but it's not as you can see it's it's orangish red but it's not that orangish it's again everyday kind of look like you just apply the lip balm on your lips and you're good to go not written but yeah it was 600 to 700 and it's in the shade 001 quickie 001 quickie i also have one more shade of this because i really like the formula and texture because it's very easy to glide on your lips and it gives that lip balm see how smooth it is it's lip balm but on a glossier side so i really like the formula so i also have this shade this is 003 fire it's pink shade again it's very light pink cute this is also for everyday look i'm sorry my puppy is barking for some reason we're gonna ignore him have really matte lipsticks so this is very orangish lipstick orangish red lipstick and this is cool toned pinkish not pinkish but like cool toned red orangish red below 200 this is literally below 200 and this one is um A thousand something this was a thousand something it's by insight matte inside matte i don't know which range it is it's not written here but it's a7 red carpet this orange -ish. not a fan of matte lipstick but this color looks good on me that's why i use this and it's stone okay somebody's calling me guys wait sorry guys it was a call from my uncle and i'm sweating like a pig oh it's so warm out here it's raining but still it's warm because it's spring season i cannot do the mats in it it's so warm but it's raining outside and i'm in spring season this is what happened in tropical areas of the world um so this is a cool toned red we're gonna apply this on this side If you can't see, I have literally 
broken it and then put it back so let's see if it still works or not now it's working i usually don't apply this because it has very much pigmented pigment and it is good for night or evening looks this magnet which is really cool i really like this kind of oh shit i really like this kind of lipstick packaging so pinkish red cool tone red warmish red i don't own so many of these colors but i do have oranges and paints so i will be making a part two of it so stay tuned for that and yeah i really look weird but i really want you guys to tell me like does cool tone lipsticks look better on me or warm toned i personally feel a warm toned looks my skin but better and cool tone looks glamorous you have it looks definitely that you have put efforts on yourself but for a good cause so i really like both of them i can't choose but i really want you to tell me which color looks better on me cool toned or warm toned so i hope you, this video was helpful in any kind of way and uh, and stay tuned for part two and i'm gonna end this video right here so thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you next time and I love you. Take care and bye.